Hello everybody, I'm Aerofade, this is 2 Minute Tips, and what you see before you are some spinning gears. In the last episode, I showed you how to build a power transfer system. This uses ropes and a rotor and some catch blocks. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how you can take rotational energy across one plane and transfer its energy into another. It's a relatively simple real world concept using gears, but here are a couple of little tweaks and tips that are not immediately obvious, which might save you a lot of pain. To get started, I'm going to come out from the gear I want to engage with by a couple of blocks and start to build up. Now I'm flipping a catch block on its side and building up along the shaft of what will become a gear rotating in the vertical axis. I'm building a gear on the horizontal axis that comes out four blocks from the hub in four directions. These will act as the teeth for our first gear. In order to get the next gear to engage properly and to give a cleaner, less self-destructive motion, I'm adding an extra block coming out parallel to the axis. I'm finishing off the vertical axis gear by once again coming out three blocks from the hub. You'll note that when a tooth from the horizontal axis is sitting at its lowest point, it is ever so slightly lower than the intersection point with the gear in the vertical axis. This is so that the teeth from the two sets of gears engage with a relatively smooth motion. To see what I'm talking about, I encourage you to go and build a set of gears without these little bits of tuning. In the next video, I'm going to show you how we can take these concepts and build a simple clutch. If you want to see more of this kind of video, please like and subscribe or pop a comment down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you later.